Hey, this is Johnny Lantern, and we're continuing our Let's Play of Morrowind Part 2. We just left Sedanin there, and we're heading just out of town. Um, we're not leaving for good. We're just heading out, because I wanted to show you guys a little something special. Uh, continuing the same thing we had going, we're going to pick up any little thing we can find. I'm not going to really dwell too much into the alchemy, but um, if you are going to get stuff, I mean, get everything. Uh, let's see, just mushrooms around here. Yeah, and those are the <laughs> smallest mushrooms you're gonna find in Morrowind. Um, we'll what? Yeah, that just happened. This guy is very interesting. He's got an awesome hat, which we're gonna take, and sword. All right, yep. Yeah. Dispose of the corpse, I think so. No one wants to see that. Let's see the book. I believe I may have found the correct formula for the spell I've been developing with it. I will be able to travel great distances without the need to pay others for the service. If all goes well, I will test out the new spell tomorrow. I believe I have worked out all the possible complications. It will allow me to leap great distances covering many hundreds of miles. Never before has one been able to travel in this manner. Vaulting from the ground, sailing through the sky. All without the terrible dis disorientation of the sp uh, spell of flying. Time is almost upon me. My research is finished, and all of the calculations are checked and rechecked. They laughed at me when I suggested this. We'll see who laughs at uh, after I leap to the top of the towers and scream out my success. Yes, I'm, I'm sure no one's laughing at you. Alright, but let's put on his hat, because that is the best hat in the game. Put the sword in my hand. Let's see. Maybe the robe. No, 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 no. Just the hat. Yes, this is how you look like. A proud warrior. Oh yeah, that is the future savior of Marwin, my friends. Yes, charge into battle. No, but uh, just around this corner is another little secret I'm going to show you guys. Yes, there's been a little uh, suspicious activity going on in Satanine. Ah, uh, yep. No, nothing in there? Alright, we'll take that. Yeah, um, craziest stuff goes on in this game. There's a lot of little side quests. Um, just like any Elder Scrolls games, you know, most of the time, you know, they don't stick out. You gotta go talk to people, um, or just discover it for yourself. I originally found this little secret when I was, uh, messing around. It's going on the outskirts of town. As, uh, I guess sketchy stuff happens when you're on the outskirts of town. I thought it was just the mud crabs at first, but further investigation will show otherwise. Look at this. It's just like a menacing area. He's... Oh, first kill! <laughs> it was a tough fight. But yeah, one of these uh, dark and gloomy trees next to some mushrooms. And this poor guy. Who could have done it? Who done it? Alright, take all this. Um, tax record. Let's see. And we can't dispose of the body, which is too bad because it's kind of gross. Alright, let's read his tax record. Let's see. Processus Vintelius Sidonine Census and Excise Office. Looks like there's a few people that paid and some people that didn't. Huh. Let's see. Wow. It's like Forian and Gilneth paid a lot. Nothing compared to what we're about to make, though. We're gonna leave this city with a little bit of extra cash in our pockets. So we'll make our way back to uh, to town and would the higher-ups know we found a dead body on the outskirts? Whoa, did you just see that? No one? So weird. Was it the murderer? Alright, I'll keep, a, keep an eye out for that. But we'll head back to the office now. Um... I have a feeling if anyone wants to know, it's going to be that guy with the name I can't pronounce. 
I didn't want your attention. Hello again. Da -da -da. All right. Don't tell him I stole stuff from here earlier, right? I must be going, so if you could make Wow, rude. I'm fine, thank you. What can I do for you? Murdered, what a waste. Processus was a good man. I've been wondering why he had, I hadn't heard from him in a few days. Still, these are dangerous times we live in, and these sorts of things happen. Did you happen to find the tax money he'd collected? I'd hate to be so callous, but I do have a job to do. Um, yeah, I found 20 seconds on him. I guess. You did. How odd that he was murdered but not robbed. Your honesty is appreciated. I can tell the, tell you that. I won't forget this, Johnny. In fact, if you're looking for some money for yourself, I'd like to see this murder of Prosius punished. Killing an emperor's tax collector is punishable by death. Find his murderer. Bring him to justice. And uh, the census and excise office will pay you 500 septums. Really? All right. I think... I think I can help you out. Alright, and murder mystery time. The murderer and Satan need. This is fun though. I uh I mean you'd expect an RPG to be like all fighting dragons all the time and I mean I guess uh Skyrim kinda is, but this is a little different. I don't mind a murder mystery. Let's see. Do you know anything about the murder? Yes, what do you want? If you're looking to get out of Satan Nine, I'll be happy to give you a little advice. How about a little secret? Daedra, you know what they are? Right, well, Daedra shrines are where Daedra cults worship Daedra. Bad people who summon bad Daedra. Stay away from them. Why? Because Daedra are nasty, and the folks that worship them are even nastier. New here, huh? Take the stilt strider to Vivek or Balmora. Fast and cheap, no trouble with animals. Wild animals and smugglers and bandits and outlaws. Go see uh, that person over in the Strider Port, over the bridge at the east along the water, and tell her that I sent you. I will do. I'll try to learn how to pronounce these names. Right, that's me. If you decide to take the still trier, tell uh, that person I sent you. Okay, let's keep asking. Under sun and sky, Outlander, we greet You're new to Seda Neen, right? I'm Andrelli Rithrian. I'm sure you have questions. Go ahead, ask. I have plenty of time. Alright, how about this murder we keep hearing about? Someone finally got him, huh? Well, it's no surprise, I suppose. No one likes a tax collector, especially one who flaunts his wealth while taking our hard-earned cash. Only one could, who could stom stomach him was uh, Thavir over in Lighthouse. The two of them spent some time together. Shame, really. She seemed like a nice woman. Okay... Well, I'm just gonna look in some sketchy parts of town. Maybe I'll find someone who's uh, a little creepy. I bet. What is a creepy guy? Outlander, what do you want? Uh, I want to know about the murder. Oh, same thing. Yeah, I'm gonna just let's go for one of these houses. Alright, and before I question this guy, I'm gonna head out. Alright, see you on part three.